How's it going, YouTube? Chris here in my home theater. I got a brand new video for you tonight. I want to be talking about Madam Web 4K UHD Blu-ray. I just had the pleasure of watching this, and uh, <clears throat> I did not buy this on digital. Uh, I guess I I watched a lot of videos of people that had come from the theater and they watched this movie and they just talked purity trash about this movie. I mean, literally, I mean, they trashed it, talked crap about it. So when it came available on digital, uh, I mean, it's it's been a few weeks ago, probably close to a month ago. I, I did not buy it when it came available. I said, I'll just wait because I had the, um, I had, I had the steel book pre-ordered and I will wait till it comes out to review it. So me and my daughter just got done watching it and, uh, I will give you my thoughts on what I thought about the movie, but I'm going to give you my thoughts on the video and the audio quality. Now, is the movie pure trash? Uh, I don't think it's absolutely pure trash. I mean, can it be better? Yes. It can be better, but, I mean, they had to do the backstory and tell you about Madam Webb and everything about her. So, I mean, I get it. I get it. Could they have done it a better way? Maybe, you know. I mean, these, uh, I guess that's why when uh, uh, Spider-Man come to the MCU, they did not do a backstory. Uh, you just saw him. He's already there. He's there, and the, the, what he uh, explains to Tony Stark is six months ago, I got my powers and blah, blah, blah. Uh, that was their story on how to bring Spider-Man into the MCU. So uh, I really don't know anything about Madam Web uh, other than what I saw in this movie. So some of you comic book guys will know more about Madam Web than I do. But I guess they had to do what they had to do to bring her into the Spider-Verse. Uh, so... It wasn't as bad, I think, as what people made it out to be. It wasn't pure trash, but it was it was decent. Let's let's just say it was a decent movie. Okay, so uh, I will leave it at that. Uh, I I enjoyed it uh, to an extent, uh, but I mean I understand they had to tell the story. So let's just say I enjoyed the movie. My, my daughter loved it. I mean, of course. I mean, I think that's the demograph that they're uh, going towards is women and girls and young women. Uh, so, I mean, of course, my daughter loved it. So I thought it was good. Okay. But so beyond that, let, let's talk about the video quality. It's a Sony movie. Uh, Sony normally does really good on their 4K UHD releases. And this is, uh, it's definitely good. Uh, I enjoyed the picture quality, uh, the bright scenes, uh, the, the motion of it, whatever. I, I didn't see any, any, any faults or anything wrong with it. My, my issue was, uh, a lot in the beginning of the movie and some towards the minute, middle of the movie, the black levels, uh, I really, I thought it looked more grayish than black. Uh, and I haven't changed anything on my projector. So, I mean, you know, mo normally uh, everything looks black if it's black. Uh, this looked kind of gray on a lot of scenes. Some scenes look blacker than others. So maybe that's a stylistic choice uh, on the movie and the way it, they shot it. Uh, but some, uh, the vast majority of scenes looked uh, uh, more gray than black. Uh, but the colors look good. I think the uh, video quality looked good. I didn't see any issues there. It's just some of the black, you know, dark scenes looked kind of grayish and not black. So, uh, 
but overall, I think it was a, a really nice transfer. Uh, Sony always does good on their transfers, and uh, I can't really fault them uh, because they pretty much uh, they 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 pretty much do a good job on their video. Uh, but this on, on the black level on a lot of the movie, a lot of the scenes looked uh, kind of grayish. Uh, but overall, was fantastic. So let, let's let's get into the sound quality, which which is what I want to focus on. Uh, from the opening of the movie, uh, there was a lot of Atmos, and I don't really think it was a static uh, because I could hear stuff panning from one side to the other in the Atmos. Uh, I mean, it it would go from like the surrounds to the atmos to the other side to the surround. Guys, I think this thing had a had a pretty decent atmos mix uh, from the beginning and the middle. Any kind, any of the scenes where she is seeing the future. You know, I don't want to spoil it for nobody when she's seeing the future. So, Madame Webb is can see the future. But any of those scenes, man, those were pretty pretty stellar atmos. And, you know, any any other scenes that she wouldn't, there were some atmos effects. It was pretty awesome, guys. Um, I thought it had a very, very good uh, bed layer uh, and an atmos effects. And it was pretty much a panning atmos. It wasn't really a static mix where it was just like, Okay, both speakers are playing here and here and over here, whatever. No, it was like this speaker, uh, this speaker back here, this speaker over here, this speaker over here, and then it will go here. I mean, it was, I thought it sounded really, really good. So, I mean, uh, kudos to uh, Sony for what they did on the uh, soundtrack. I mean, I think they did a very good job on the Atmos uh, for this movie. Uh, and uh, we're going to get into the Base. This movie had a lot, a lot, a lot of bass. And uh, not only just bass, but subsonic bass. I mean, my <laughs> my daughter, she said, she kept looking at me. She's like, whoa. <laughs> I mean, it was a lot of subsonic bass that rumbled the chairs. And I'd look at her and it's like, what do you think about that? She's like, that's cool, Dad. So, I mean, I thought it was a uh, pretty awesome uh, bass in the movie. And it, it wasn't all subsonic, but the movie, for the most part, had very, very, very good rate, bass response. And I was pretty, pretty excited and happy for what uh, Sony did in this mix. Uh, good LFE response, good subsonic response, good Atmos. Uh, so I think it's a very good track. So whether you like the movie or not, I mean, when you listen to it, I mean, I think your eyes will be, you know, pretty excited about what you're seeing, and your ears are going to be pretty pleased at what you're hearing. Uh, so, guys, I really, honestly, I think uh, you will enjoy this movie if you decide to pick it up. I mean, and listen to the naysayers, and they say, uh, this movie's crap. And listen, it, it, this is not an end game movie. Uh, this is not you know, end game. Okay. So this is not Spider-Man homecoming or Spider-Man no way home. I mean, this is not a run of the mill, you know, high end, whatever Spider-Man movie or end game movie, you know, just going to make billions of dollars. It's not, but it, I think overall it's a good Spider-Woman movie. Uh, I mean, cause that's all that's in there, uh, is a spider, spider women. And, uh, I honestly think, you know, it, it's, it's, it's not bad. Uh, but the sound and the video quality, I mean, guys, it is, it, it'll, it'll, it'll tickle your system and you'll be like, man, this does look and sound good. So I, I recommend picking it up, uh, like I said, I was lucky enough to get the steel book. That's what it looks on the back. Uh, I still got it in my player, so that's what it looks like. Let me get it straight. That's what it looks like on the inside. 
So guys, honestly, I do, I do, I do recommend this. I mean, hey, I mean, hey, pick, if if you're a collector like me, hey, pick it up for your collection because I've got I've got all Marvel movies, every one of them. I don't have the older, real older stuff that you know that was on TV back when I was younger, uh, but it's available if you want to pay the price they asking for it. Uh, but anyway, I mean, guys, I, I do recommend Madam Web. There it is, Madam Web, 4K UHD, Dolby Atmos. It's a, it's a, it's a very good mix. Very good, very good picture. I mean, it's Sony, guys. You know, Sony and uh, these other companies. They're, they're, you know, Universal and even, even Warner Brothers. I mean, they. I feel like they knock it out of the park when they do uh in Lionsgate normally. I mean a lot everybody but Disney. I mean they Disney falls short, I feel like, a lot of times. So but all these other companies, man, they knock it out of the park with the video quality. That's that's what I feel. And Sony is right there on the top in Universal and Lionsgate and so forth and so on. I mean, they, these guys do a good job on video and a lot of times they do a good job on audio. And uh, Madam Web is a good, good, good video. So, guys, hey, check it out. I mean, if you want to pick it up, it'll be available tomorrow. Um, Walmart decided to send me my copy today, and I was glad they did. And I got all the other videos, uh, uh, Andor and uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi and all those. I mean, they, they, I pre-ordered those, and they sent them all to me today. So I was I was pretty cool that they sent me those videos today. So that's why I was able to check out Madam Web, and uh, it'll be available tomorrow. Pick it up, and uh, guys, let me know in the comments. Maybe you bought it in digital. Uh, the, the if you bought it in digital, I can I can guarantee you this this uh, physical media copy is going to be better. And uh, man, I really enjoyed it. Me and my daughter sat there and watched it, and we really enjoyed the physical media copy and i'm sure we'd enjoyed the uh, digital copy but i didn't buy it just because i heard bad things uh but i bought the physical media and i'm not disappointed i mean some of y'all might but uh overall guys it was good a lot of times uh, the bass would shake the chairs and uh, i thought it was pretty cool man uh the whole movie was pretty awesome so guys, let me know in the comments if you have uh, checked it out. And uh, if you haven't, let me know if you've decided to pre-order it or pick it up tomorrow. Just let me know in the comments. And uh, guys, we're going to see you again next video. i got some more videos coming up. I did not get to uh, get to the sofa baton today, uh, but i got to get to it real soon. So we'll see you again in the next video.